Greetings and welcome to Living Supernaturally. Thank you so much for giving us this opportunity to come together even as we spend a few moments to meditate on God's word and pray together. This week we'll be talking about choices. Now each one of us will make choices in our lives. Whether we are young, old, whether we're working professionals or even homemakers, we will make choices. And the choices we make will determine our attitude and our attitude. Nehemiah chapter 9 verses 25 and 26. And they took strong cities and a rich land and possessed houses full of all goods, cisterns already dug, vineyards, olive groves, and fruit trees in abundance. So they ate and were filled and grew fat and delighted themselves in your great goodness nevertheless they were disobedient and rebelled against you cast your law behind their backs and killed your prophets who testified against them to turn them to yourself and they worked great provocations god chose to make israel his vehicle of love He wanted them to be a light to the nations. In today's verses, Israel recalls God's actions with their ancestors. God gave them kingdoms and the nations. He made their children as numerous as the stars in the sky. He chose them for a purpose to reveal his love and faithfulness to a nation and blessing them abundantly. As Israel began this new journey to with God who had chosen them they confessed they had made wrong choices they had made unwise choices as well success had made Israel go away from God rather than to God and they wanted to do whatever their heart desired God gave them salvation yet they worshiped other gods Nehemiah wrote and he says as soon as they were at rest which means as soon as they were comfortable they did evil in the eyes of God Israel chose to live on terms on their lives rather than on God's You and I will make choices choices towards big decisions choices that can alter the directions of our lives You will either choose to increase your kingdom or God's kingdom. You will choose to do your will or God's will. You will choose to love or to hate. But the biggest choice made in our life was that God first loved us and God first chose us. I want to end with Joshua 24:15. Joshua is exhorting the israelites and he says to them choose this day whom you are going to serve but as for me and my household we will serve the lord whom are you going to choose this day let's pray father we want to thank you for the wisdom upon our lives we pray god that you will teach us to make the right choices And Holy Spirit you will direct us you will speak to our innermost being Lord that every choice we make will be in tune and in line with your will for our lives We thank you for the Holy Spirit in us to lead and direct us help us to be sensitive and obedient to the working of your Holy Spirit in our lives We thank you Father in Jesus name we pray Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.